Guys, Marcus Greaves here. I'm, I just want to give you my quick three reasons why I think Thomas Tyner should stay one last season at Oregon State. My first reason is he's obviously going to be the starter. We know Thomas Tyner is a super talented running back. He has all the traits to be a big-time player. He was a big-time player, you know, in his first couple seasons with the University of Oregon. And especially with this new offensive coordinator, Brian Lingrid, that, they had, that Oregon State got, who loves running the ball, you can tell, because Philip Lindsay – you know, when he was at Colorado, Philip Lindsay ran the ball over 300 times, which is absolutely incredible, and that's insane. I couldn't even imagine that. But, you know, if Thomas Tyner could even get, uh, you know, half of those carries, it would be huge for him. And, and with the limited amount of carries that Thomas Tyner got this last season, we've seen what he can do with it. So I think, first of all, like he's, like I said, being the starter is huge. My second reason is he's finally going to be back in his groove. You know, after taking two years off and then trying to come back, it's that's not many people can do that. So first of all, that already says a lot about what kind of player he is, because if he can come back and still make an impact after having a year or two off, that's huge. You know, because I know right now, if I tried to come back, there's no chance. I mean, you know, as much as I'd like to say it, there's just no chance I could do that. So the, with him being back in his groove, he's going to be an even better player than we've seen last year. And on top of that, like I said, more carries, it's going to be huge. My last reason is his draft stock is going to be a lot higher next year than this year. This year, there's there's an unreasonable amount of backs that are going in the draft. As we see, you know, there's Saquon Park, Barkley, there's Bryce Love, Nick Chubb, Darius Geis, you know, Ronald Jones from USC, Royce Freeman from Oregon. There's, you know, the, it's just if you have, if, if Thomas Tyner didn't, perform like we know he should have then there's no I just think it's smart for him to stay this last season because if he gets back in his groove he gets the carries he deserves and he has you know he's a Thomas Tyner like we've seen before then his draft stock is going to be huge because at one point he was you know considered a top five back in the draft and that was only as a you know freshman or sophomore so those are my quick three reasons why I think Thomas Tyner needs to stay for his last season it's going to be huge for Oregon State if he does and stay tuned for my next video